What's up, my VR Bears? Welcome to another New Game Monday. Today, we will be reviewing Mayor. Make sure you hit that like button and leave a comment down below telling me what game I should do next week. And with that being said, let's hop straight into today's video. Mayor Created by Vision Trick Media is an interactive story game that will run you about $20 on the Oculus Store. This native to the Quest game is a stunningly beautiful display of what the Quest is truly capable of. Unlike last week's installment of New Game Monday, I don't have the same positive remarks about this one. With that being said, this game is still Vision Trick's art piece and I am going to say some not so nice things about it. I don't condone hating on someone's art. This video is merely supposed to be a review on the game with some jabs in order to make the content more entertaining to watch. With that disclaimer out of the way, let's get started. The game starts off with a very cinematic view of some clouds. Yeah, clouds. 30 seconds of clouds. Then finally a bird flying around for another 30 seconds. Then after a full minute of waiting, we finally begin the game with possibly the worst tutorial I have ever seen. By trying to keep the immersion, this tutorial decides not to use text, nor dialogue, in order to explain the mechanics or even what to actually do in the tutorial. As you can see on screen, I was stuck at the beginning of the tutorial with no idea how to progress because the tutorial was so convoluted. By the time you get to the actual game, none of the puzzles actually make any sense. The premise of the game is that you are an electric bird who is guiding a little girl to safety. You do this by ringing bells and knocking leaves off of trees. Did I read that right? Is knocking leaves off of trees really a main mechanic of the game? Putting that aside, the game to put it bluntly is just boring. The visuals are stunning and the art style is amazing, but there is virtually no story and no gameplay. The puzzles are both simultaneously easy and make absolutely no sense at the same time. The girl you're trying to save is both scared and happy to see you. Altogether, the game makes for a very confusing, weird, uncomfortable, and boring experience that in my opinion is 100% not worth $20. The game itself definitely feels more like an art piece rather than a story or game. I could go on and on about the things I disliked about this game, like the fact that you're always having to look down because of the position of your character, which leads to the neck cramps as well as poor vision as no headset works fantastically while looking down. Like really, who thought they should make a game where you have to look down the whole entire time? I literally had to sit down to finish playing the second level. Like I said, I can go on, but I don't want to drag this video, so I'm just going to give my final remarks. If you like beautiful VR graphics and that's it, then this game is for you. But if you are looking for a game or even a story that has more detail than just watching a girl walk around stairs for 40 flippin' minutes, then pass on this game. Personally, I only played the first two levels as I wanted to be under two hours of playtime so that I could return the game once I had enough footage for this video. The game could very well have gotten significantly better as I got to the later levels, but I couldn't possibly justify buying a game for $20 that not only I didn't enjoy, but fully felt like it was an actual waste of time. But once again, this game definitely does have a market. It is a very 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 niche market the market of people who just want to see something stunning in vr if that is you you might enjoy this game as the graphics are beautiful but if you want any form of story or any form of gameplay that challenges skills or really needs to be in vr none of this game needed to be in vr you could easily have made this a point and click with a mouse so if you're looking for a game that needs to be in vr that is entertaining and fun to play this is not it but if you are looking for that beautiful experience, you might find it with Mare. That is going to wrap up today's video. If you enjoyed, please hit that like button down below. And if you've made it this far, please consider subscribing if you want to see more by me. Leave a comment telling me what your favorite part of the video was, and I'll be sure to heart it. Thank you to my members. You guys are absolute mad lads. My little lettuces. 
and my mama bears thank you very much for your support and thank you all very much for watching and i'll see you all in the next one peace out everybody bye